Hey, I big We're going to war. We're going to war. We're going to war. We're going to war. Wait, wait. Oh, she's got to be dreaming. I thought those was the kids from that season. Oh yeah, definitely a dream. <laughs> what did you say? Said Padre. Oh. Yo, is she? She can't be turning because it don't take that long. And this is the whole thing I was trying to figure out last, 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 uh, you know, in the, in the season, the mid-season finale. I kept saying, how the fuck can she be turning and it take this goddamn long? Where the hell is she? And she ain't got no hand. I gotta be honest, I still can't believe they fucking had to lose her hand. They ain't need to do that. <laughs> someone here. She ain't in the towel, that's for damn sure. Or is she dreaming that she woke up from a dream? Alright, who that? You don't broke that man's radio. What did you do? <laughs> Saved your life. Who the fuck are you? Yeah, I'm confused. I'm guessing this guy's some type of music savant. Didn't you hear me? No. Oh, he's partially deaf. I didn't. I see the thing in his head. I haven't heard a goddamn thing in months. I'm gonna have to speak a lot slower if you expect me to read your lips. Oh. How long have I been out? Two days. Wait, where I know this brother from? How did I get here? I brought you here. I was coming back from a food run, found you passed out in a barn about two miles north. Good thing I came along when I did. I, I, I checked on you, saw your arm, or what's left on your arm. That's quite a statement. I wasn't gonna let him take it from me. But why haven't you turned? I if it come from a bite, you would have turned by now. Exactly. What's left of it 
didn't look infected. Still, you were burning up no matter how much medicine I gave you. So? Why are you idling so hot? I, I appreciate your help. I, um, I really have to go. There are people that are counting on me. Your dad? You kept saying Padre over and over in your sleep. Uh, he said your dad. I must have been confused. Hold on a second. You broke my stereo after what I did for you. At least you can do is help me. Uh, I'm uh, really sorry, but I, I have to go. Oh, whoa, whoa. Hey, back off! A little jumpy there, ain't you? You are no safe to go anywhere. I'm Paul, by the way. You never answered my question before. About your fever? This is one hell of a nice guy. He can't know I'm here. Why? Please. Okay. Something I can help you boys with? Well, we're looking for somebody. He can't hear you. Can't hear shit. So if you got something to say, you're gonna have to show your face. Hmm. When hasn't kicked up anything dangerous in weeks. She has a habit of getting people hurt. What do you want with her? Oh, it's between me and her. He's hiding in the fucking piano. Piano's broken. Decided to tune song. You sure? <laughs> There's really nowhere else for to hide for some of that piano. All right then. You see here, you give me a call. How is he supposed to do that if he can't hear you? I'll do that. Things went bad and he blames me. Is he right to? He doesn't like where I let everyone. We had to abandon where we were living because the blast compromised the structure. Where was that? They got two deaf people. <laughs> Him wow. and Connie. You seem nice enough to me. Then again. I may just be grateful for the company. Bon appetit. What the hell is that? Wait a minute, how the fuck does he have lights? I guess he has a fucking solar panel too. <laughs> I take it you never had haggis. Oh, it's haggis. Oh, God. Rowan was Scottish. Always kept hands of this stuff in the pantry. And if I'm being honest, I had to say... I was just about to say, she ain't Scottish. What the fuck are you feeding her that shit but for? I am. Rowan, is she your... Was. My wife. That's why you don't play those bagpipes. What happened? The bombs did. Lost her. And what's left of my hearing? Oh, okay, that explains it. I'm sorry. So am I. I'm going to turn in. We need the dawn. I got some new stereo. Uh, look, I appreciate everything you've done, but I, I really do have to go. Why are you in such a hurry to? She got shit to do, nigga. You ain't. Oh my god. Because what Arno said about me is true. Look, a lot of people got hurt because of me, and I don't want that to happen what again. What happened in that place you were at before? She told you. Why is the guy really after you? It doesn't matter. And what does? Getting back to my friends. Their lives are at stake. So it's mine. Though it didn't work out with Padre. Big deal. You tried. And people died. Did you put a gun to the head and force them to follow you over there? There must have been a reason for you to think this is the way to go. Yeah, I did. 
Then why beat yourself up? <laughs> Damn. Okay, Mr. Optimistic. <laughs> Beethoven's Ninth. Last concert we ever had here. <laughs> He's like the black version that of the of the white mean? guy in in uh, the regular Beethoven. Walking Dead. What happened to that nigga? I forgot his name, but what happened to fucking the musician guy from the regular Walking Dead? Where the fuck is he? He had an arrangement of Old to Joy all figured out for those pipes. That was her dream. But she never got to play. When my hearing started going. She thought maybe I just might be able to hear that. Bagpipes are awful. So damn loud. <laughs> yeah. Bagpipes to me are like the Why most annoying instrument. I told her. That's not how it was meant to be played. But really, I, I, I was just so damn mad at my world going quiet that I took it out on her. What else would I do? Come with me. You just admitted to getting people That's fucking hurt. I ain't going with your ass nowhere. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> What's wrong? Right here. And why would she go out there? That was so stupid. I'm not alone. I figured that too. Come on out. Alright, yeah, you can't hear us. You're dead. Because you said you knew the way. Seems only fair that you join them, Alicia. Halfway there, anyway. <laughs> oh shit! No. Oh! Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh, there go your peoples. There go your peoples. Ah, this nigga gonna get away. He ran out of bullets. Oh shit, now that one's broken too. What are you doing? I can fix it. Oh nigga, get your ass in there! Stupid motherfucker! Shit! <laughs> that warhead came crashing down with this horrible high pitched whine. Dizzy scream. And everything just went quiet. Damn. That was the last thing I ever heard. Her scream. My woman. So I have a voice I can't get rid of either. What voice? One from my dream. What dream? A dream I've been having for months, a dream I keep having. You asked me why I thought Padre was the place I had to take everyone. That's why. Now that voice is all I can hear. Hmm. Every time I close my eyes. Every time I manage to fall asleep. Stop punishing yourself for something that's not your fault. Look, even if Arno's gone, this voice is not going to go away. Maybe it's not meant to be silenced. Mm. Huh. What a way to look at it. But you said... I said we can drown out the voices that we don't want to hear. Maybe you should keep listening to the voices from your dreams. This is some weird shit right now. I'm not gonna lie. They taking this show in a weird philosophical direction. People used to call him the Texas first one. My older brother, damn near just as good. So when I started taking lessons, I thought I could play like them. Who are you? I know you're in there. You're here. I was about to say, I think he heard him. I forgot. He can't hear. It's gonna get loud. Hmm? Hmm? 
No, you're in there, Alicia. <laughs> nigga, you got one hand too now, nigga. Where are you? Come on out. I hope they took those other motherfuckers' guns. Because they never show how they made it out that car. I'm sure she doesn't sneak out the back. God damn! Ladies and gentlemen, thank you, thank you. Oh fuck! Don't waste your bullets. He's wasting his bullets, and I don't see any guns that. Did they really not take the guns that those people had? This is pretty cool. There's nothing better than fucking an, uh, an awesome action scene with some opera music playing in the background. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Slap nuts, choke on that! <laughs> he came out thinking of Jeff Jarrett, son! <laughs> oh, there you go. Oh shit, nigga, you about to die. Oh no, he about to die! Oh shit, you're both about to die! Damn! This nigga is still alive. Please kill him! Oh, uh, here we go. And now we're fucking listening to corn. She could have went around and killed him, man. She really could have. She could have went all. She could have went back and she could have doubled back in the house and fucked that nigga up. Look, my mom had her dream. Nick had his. You have yours. I've always had such strong True. voices around me. I've never stopped to really listen to mine. Okay, this is kind of making but sense. But I am now. So where will you go? The bunker. There's a working transmitter down there, and I need it to reach people. Because that walker, I thought it would lead us to Padre. But I was wrong, because I don't think Padre even exists. You're going to become Padre? I'm going to give them what they want. A safe place to live. OK. And that's how we get our army. That's how we take the tower from Strand. Good luck me. convincing people to do I that. Because when I come back, that's when we make our move. Jesus. God damn. It's the fucking whisperers all over again. How many do you think there are? Yo, with all this fucking nuclear shit going around, one of them gets out. What if these things evolve in some fucking way? I'm gonna take the tower for ourselves. Everybody going to fight for that fucking tower. So, that episode was a fucking weird one, you know? Um, <laughs> not not too much action, but, you know, it's the first episode in the, in the, in the, in the mid-season uh, premiere or whatever. Is it mid-season premiere or season? No, mid-season premiere. Um, so, shit is getting crazy. Shit is getting fucking crazy. Um, I don't know how this chick ain't dead. I don't know how she didn't turn. I don't know what's going on with this fucking fever. I was hoping the death god was going to live, but of course that was impossible. That's not going to happen. That wasn't going to happen. But the only thing that really bothered me was she could have doubled back and killed this nigga after he shot the dude. Or why he was, you know, 
Like, what the fuck? He played that music just so she could run away. She should have came back and killed him. There were so many opportunities, in my opinion, for him to actually, for her to actually kill him, but she didn't. Um, uh, they're going to try to take the tower. Alicia's going to try to get some people to take the fucking tower. This is going to be some crazy-ass shit. Um, I still want to know what happened to them kids from a few seasons ago, but then again, there was a, there was a point where I actually stopped watching the shit because it was getting really stupid, so I may have missed what happened, but if you guys know, let me know, you know, <laughs> but anyway, not a bad episode, I liked it, glad the, uh, you know, fear is back, to be honest with you, I completely forgot that it came back, I didn't know when it was gonna premiere, um, I just happened to see, um, I happened to see something on, on, on like my YouTube suggestion. Of, uh, somebody was reviewing the episode. So I was like, wait a minute, the episode came on already? And that's what happened. So that's what led me to this reaction. So anyway, like, comment, subscribe. Fear the Walking Dead. A track Brown. P.W. Hustle. Back in the fold on some Walking Dead shit. This is what fucking started it all for this channel pretty much. Well, not started it all for the channel, but started it all for the reactions in general. So, Fear the Walking Dead is back. I'm back with it, and i see you guys later, all right? Follow me on Twitter, 8 Dastardly, the number 8, T-R-A-C, Dastardly. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification button, and join the PW Hustle Facebook group. All right, guys? I'm going to go listen to my vinyls. Before I head to work. Peace.